Microsoft recently released the consumer preview of their newest version of Windows, Windows 8. The user interface in Windows 8 has been totally redesigned, from how you log on to the start screen, which is patterned after the Windows phone and uses the Metro design. The Metro start screen consists of colorful tiles in varying sizes. These are the applications. The Metro apps are live, which means that if applicable, they will display up-to-date information in the tile itself. For example, the weather application would display the current weather, or the calendar application would display the current meetings. The start screen is fully customizable. You could choose to unpin an application from the start screen, uninstall the selected application, change the size of the tile, or turn a live tile off. You can move tiles around so the applications you used most often are visible. You can also create groups for the tiles and name the groups as a way to keep related information together. You do have the ability to see all of your applications if needed. Here you can also pin and unpin the application to the start screen or to the desktop taskbar depending on what type of application it is. Yes, the desktop is still available and will appear when you're running desktop-based Windows applications like Microsoft Office. The Windows 8 navigation allows you to view and move to the applications that are currently open. Whether it's the last application you just used or all of the open applications. And to close an application, simply drag it down to the bottom of the screen. The new charms bar appears on the right side of the screen when you move to that area. You'll find charms for search, share, start, devices, and settings. Although this is just a brief look at the consumer preview of Windows 8, I hope you're as excited as we are and looking forward to the final release of Windows 8 later this year.